Anyway, let's do this. Guys, potential final lobby of the day, and we are doing Hedgehogs and Blowfish only. A classic. Classic Hedge and Blow. When you end your turns, please only have Hedgehogs or Blowfish or Sloths in your team. Uh, any food is allowed, including honey. And uh, yeah, that's the rules. You can buy and sell anything else. Go crazy. Do I want to go for pig or do I want to go for duck? Let's go for pigs. It's like already here. And there's already two of them. Okay. Come on, one more. I want to do it this turn. Well, not this turn, but, you know, <laughs> before tier 2 unlocks. Uh, let's get the Untouched Siblings. Almost a curse name. You like on Twitch, you can actually get in the lobby. YouTube was hard for this. It is. It was interesting on YouTube that it, like, filled up so fast. But, I don't know. I like having the bigger lobbies, too. I know more people on YouTube. Yeah, I did a uh, YouTube stream on Wednesday, and we had, like... I mean, to be fair, the viewership like built up over time, so I don't I don't really know where to lead the average, but by the end of the viewer lobbies, we had like 250 people there, and the viewer lobbies were filling up, you know, maxing out to 64 people in like, you know, 20 seconds or something, so. <laughs> it was very fast. Anyway, I'm going to see if I can get this pig combo, and I cannot, sadly, so now I'm rolling for a sloth. Haha. <laughs> Any sloths for Kino? Three pigs got a rat. Hey, at least you got a combo. No turn one hedgehogs. Shame. Although Froggy got one. Wait. <laughs> Congrats. Oh, and I'm sorry you can get in hatches. I wonder if I did like rolling till I found them. Um... I don't know, if I got like a duck combo and I did it next turn and found a blowfish from that, that'd be really cool. But it's like an extra like 2 HP. Alright, honey, great. Double, oh, perfect. That's like the perfect opener. <laughs> I don't think I can lose unless I go against someone else that got like an early hedgehog plus this kind of luck. So, let's see. Raiden's got an early one. Froggy got an early one. There they are. Why did you sell the pig right now? I got the extra gold I can't use. Wait, so hatches is the right way? I wasn't sure whether to like emphasize the <laughs> the chos part. No way this man just double hogged. Yes way. It happened. And I'm ready. I just need like more honey on this, more of these. I'd probably like buy sell some otters or something, but I don't really want to invest in hedgehogs too much. I'd rather just have like a big team of um blowfish. Oh, you pilled a spider and got a giraffe. I actually forgot about, like, killing spiders. That could be an idea. <laughs> what is this team? I see a spider, but I'm, I'm leaving it. But if I go against another hedgehog, the stats won't matter anyway. Let's look for levels. Okay, if I pill this, I have, like, a 1 in 11 chance or something of getting a blowfish, and it would be a very tiny blowfish. And nothing else matters. I, I'm just going to keep rolling. That's, that's like 3 gold for a 1 in 11 chance of something. Let's just keep rolling for the hedgehogs. That's all I really care about here. Another one. Nice. Maybe should have taken more honey. Okay. Pill it, you won't. You're right, I won't. When I'm bored, I just no way this man just, and then whatever Kino just did. I'd say I feel that, but I can't relate at all. <laughs> I think they're not in my pack. Have you not found any hedgehogs? Oh, it's an Aussie nickname. I have not heard it. Maybe not surprising, because I'm not Australian. <laughs> Alright. Sure. Oh, oh, beautiful. This is all lovely stuff. Let's start with this. I don't need any of these. <laughs> I am ready, though. This is a lovely opener. I want to see someone get to sloth in this lobby. Stream it up for real. Jesus, what a team. It's it's really coming together. Wait, Cynicals, we have the same team. I want to see. I obviously can't see it, though. I'd have to check at the start of the next one. <laughs> Sorry, he's one that says pill it. People really want to see me, like, pilling hedgehogs in these teams. And I won't. I won't do it. Someday, I'll actually, like, benefit from pilling a hedgehog onto my team. But this isn't it. If you do, like, gorillas only, maybe. Well, you know, any, like, primates only. I could maybe fit it in. 
Sloth would be so bad for this lobby. Uh, it might not actually not be that bad. Potentially late game, a Sloth could be better than um, a Hedgehog. But that's only if you don't have a lot of like Blowfish yourself and you don't want to like get extra triggers for the opponent's Blowfish. I wonder if I even buy more of these or if I roll for like levels and stats. Because I think I'd rather combine these soonish. I want to find more Blowfish. <laughs> don't do the salads either. This is like stack that on here. Maybe on the front one. Because like everything's going to explode anyway. I might as well get like one more attack damage on something at the front. Wait, what happened? The poor poor sloth if it ends up here. It's D Day for the lad. Five four pit to the spill headshot goes insane. I mean, I I see it. I think it's a lot of setup though, because that's like a lot of gold. And your team will have to have like only pit bread for a while. Kino is too scared to fill the hedgehog. He's not ready for the immense power it brings to his team. There's no immense power. It just explodes everything. And also, this is fine. It's a win. <laughs> Got worried. Okay. I do want to find more blowfish, though. Like, I do feel like having more blowfish on your team helps out a lot later. We'll buy... Yeah, I'll buy these. It's a pair as well, maybe. Okay. Well, I haven't found any more Blowfish, but if I buy them, then they're going to be like 5 sevens, so pretty good. And does the Hedgehog have cute pink painted nails? Oh my god, it actually kind of does. Why does it have like painted nails? There's no way Hedgehogs just have like pink nails. If they even have nails, I don't know what that like poor things look like. Fit on everything that Pill Hedgehog. That's what they were saying. But like you'd have to buy like four Pitta. It's like, that's still a big investment. It's not just the, you know, pilling a hedgehog is amazing. It's a, you just have to buy this 10 other things. They do have pinkish toes. I just like know nothing about them. Like I've seen operas <laughs> hedgehog a little bit, but I, I definitely can't remember the feet. And I can't remember the last time I saw one myself. Uh, I'm also going to combine here because like, I'm more likely to find a cow than, you know, a lot of other things and... I don't know, if I find a turkey, I can maybe combine again and, you know, buy that. But yeah, let's start by throwing this on here. And it's a scorpion, not what I wanted. Uh, yes, we buffed this. We need these to be large. Oh, that's all my gold, huh? <laughs> okay. Uh, swap these around. And if I happen to run into another massive hedgehog and it doesn't, um... No, it will, like, explodes anyway. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter where these are. I was going to say, like, I didn't want this one at the front because it's going to insta-kill this, but even this one's going to insta-kill these ones and kills this one. And that's not even assuming my other opponent has hedgehogs of their own, so... Yeah, I don't think it's worth, like, worrying about. And is Melon Armor even good here? It can be for your frontliner. Whatever you have at the front, it might benefit from it. Hey! No, they had ease. I thought it was going to be a draw. But yeah, anything behind is almost definitely going to get sniped off with a really low damage thing, like a Hedgehog or Blowfish trigger. Delete leave all of this. That's... those are stats. Okay, I'm going to combine this into there. I'm not going to do other weird stuff, I think. So, throw that there. Buy, sell. I would like to find another Blowfish soon, please. I will do that and just end my turn. Okay. I don't know, maybe I should have moved this one further forward? <laughs> I'm lost, no idea. Ah. Look at it though, beautiful. Backline hedgehog. See, that's a good idea if um you think your blowfish are going to survive, like, <laughs> the explosions. Very nice garlic hedgehog. You haven't found garlic yet, you're crying? Oh god, that would hurt. Hey, found another one, nice. Uh, I may just like combine that in, honestly. Or maybe I start by buying blowfish and then these, but... I don't know, let's freeze this, I'm just gonna roll. Okay, this I like a lot. Throw this on here. 
Dragon, no, just keep doing this. And then next turn, I think I'm going to combine this Hedgehog into that one, buy another Blowfish. And... I don't know, I can even combine it to there. Probably not, though. Anyway, this is going to die, like, very soon, because, <laughs> like, these two alone do six damage. You're dead, so you can actually watch the scream? You... Wait, you died already, Terry? Oh, no. Okay, I think I'm okay against this team, because I have a high level Blowfish. <laughs> I do, like, two damage on the Scythe instead of one. To a garlic thing, I mean. And I did win, but barely. Hmm. Okay, oh, pizza is lovely too. Okay, I'm gonna start by throwing it on here, but I think ideally I'm going to end up with like three blowfish, one hedgehog, and a buy sell slot. So, uh. I don't know, I could end up with two things. Maybe I do just unfreeze that. Like, what's good for buy selling? It's just like snail if I lose, and then cows. That's not bad, but yeah, I think I just like buy things then. All right, never mind. So this is the team. <laughs> this is the team. I definitely want more garlic on here. Uh, no idea where to leave that, so I'm gonna leave it there. And Magneto, hello. Just got into support events recently and found your stream. Well, I hope you enjoy yourself here. Can we do buffing pet only, like ant, penguin, etc. It's difficult to say what is and isn't a buffing pet. Because, like, to me, that word is scalers. But I feel like a lot of scalers are... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. End of turn scalers is very obvious. But a lot of other scalers, uh, it's hard to tell if they actually are scalers or not. Because they're, um... I don't know. Like, do you call a beetle a scaler? Because if you give it food, it permanently scales something in the shop. Because, in my mind, I don't know. I'm also leaving the cats and stuff. Like, this is the team. This is what I'm sticking with. Now I just start buying stats and equipment. Still on max HP. Oh, yeah, one of, you're one of three. I'm still up there. Like, top five-ish. Top six. Hmm. Are shop scalers counted as scalers? That's what I'm saying. Like, it's so hard to tell. We need, like, clear... Definitions on everything. Will Beetle even be good? No, but the point is to try and like get the rules out before we start. And they need to be like understandable, you know? Like the more people have to ask whether something's allowed or not, it's, like the more messy it gets and the more cheating there is. Unintentional cheating, but you know. You just want to avoid that stuff if you can. Uh yeah, I mean throw it on there. I can, like melon one of these. It might do something, but not really invested yet. Brawling, that is okay food. Not insane, but like, there aren't many good stat foods up here. It's like, you know, pear, sushi, pizza. And honestly, at this stage, like, I don't think salad's that much worse than pear, so. You know, I want those. I maybe want mushrooms for my hedgehogs. And uh, yeah, chocolate. I want to level. Level my back line as much as I can. Have you done a push-only lobby yet? I don't think so. It's been suggested a few times, and I think I tried to make a pack, and I may have, like, <laughs> abandoned it. Scalers must be able to give permanent buffs. No! If I had one more B! Ah. <laughs> if I just had a little bit more. Hey. I like that. I will not be touching this apple. Also, I just realized this does not have equipment. I need more garlic, please. Pretty badly. Unless I want to, like, I don't know, stick a steak on it and throw it to the front. So shop scaling doesn't count. Would it not, though? My shooting hedgehog is just a madman move. I think it depends on how, like, which person has more and higher level blowfish. Because, like, obviously if you just have a team of hedgehogs and you want to, like, mushroom all your hedgehogs, then... You're basically just doing more damage to your own team, because the enemy team is going to have, like, loads of giant garlic hedgehogs, blowfish. But, uh, yeah, if you have a team like this, I think it could be decent having some mushroom ones on here. I just want these to be, like, another level higher. Look how close the fights are, like, every round. Because, like, I'm buying stat food. I'm sorry, cow. You can't... You can't get in here. 
<laughs> yeah, how are the teams looking? There's not many level 3 blowfish around, to be honest. It's like I may be safe to do this. And it's just kind of funny, so... I'm going to do it on here. I don't actually want to do more damage to my blowfish, so I'm just going to do it on the smaller one. Is all blowfish a good strategy? I mean, probably? I think it also depends, like, what you're going against, because... If you happen to have an all blowfish team and you go against a team that's just full of hedgehogs, then like you're probably going to have the advantage. But I don't know. Hey, like, this is worrying for me because he has like so much more HP and does a lot more damage. <laughs> Three HP. Oh, it's always so close. Even the winds are really close, but. I almost want to do that, but I do feel like it's a waste. Yeah, that cow should not have stayed there. Uh, let's just keep rolling. Like, I need to focus on getting some more stats and levels here. If I can just get, like, this thing leveled up and a little bit chunkier, then I might be okay. Still need garlic for this. It's got demolished by a 40-something blowfish. I did see that one. Like, there's one here that's, like, a 30-30. Another one that's, like, there. Yeah, there's some very large ones around. Oh god, top team is getting scary too. Single bigger blowfish is better than multiple decent blowfish, it seems. Yeah. It is definitely looking like that. But also, like, I can't just... do that. <laughs> like, you know, sure, I could have had, like, you know, just sold a hedgehog at some point and combined these ages go, but, like, they wouldn't actually be that much larger. Because most of these stats I've been getting from, like, you know, wide scaling food, I haven't been, like, buying pears and pizza too much. Uh, anyway, we're just gonna buy all these. If I die, I die. I'll embrace it. I'm just gonna leave the salad bowl. Like, it's good, but if I can find the level for this just slightly sooner, it may make a difference. It was a good run. It was, yeah, it was an attempt. Let's have, like, one final little browse through. Yeah, I, <laughs> I'm thinking XRB might have this one. It's still flawless crushing everyone. Oh no, it's another... I mean, this one is smaller, so, like, maybe I have a chance. But then this one is extremely large, so maybe not. Nah. No. <laughs> All right. Yep, I'm dead. Uh, well, GG's guys. It's a fun lobby anyway. It's always fun to do some um, hedge and blow, classic. All right, I think I will do another one quickly though. So I'm just going to like, wait, maybe this is where we do the slugs only 30 second lobby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Okay, hold on. Let me find my filler pack. We're not going to be leaving this one for too long, because, again, I normally swap in, like, 10 minutes. Hold on, did I save red? If I did, then I can just import over it. I did. Cool. Okay, filler. Let's find slug. He is here. Slugs only, let's go. We're doing slugs only, but with a very low timer. So it's going to be fast. So if you guys uh, normally struggle with your having enough time for things, then <laughs> watch out. I don't think I need to worry about other things here. I don't think there's any like specific food that I get to add. Like, you could do mushrooms or something, but I don't know if people are gonna care. Wait, is this long battle low time? Kind of? I don't know, someone su suggested this earlier and it seems kind of fun. Well, Slug Battle's gonna take a hundred years. Like, it's not gonna take that long. Like, these are pretty... This is pretty fine. Save back. Right, so I need to change this. I'm going to change it to 35, so not like all the way down, but we're down to 35 from 65, so it is basically half. Mm, Slugma. Like the Pokemon. Nothing else. <laughs> right. Slugs only. Fast timer. And there's no way there's a slug emoji, right? Do I have to use, like, a snail? 
I'm using snail emoji. <laughs> Maybe this is a slug like emoticon. Does the battle still run into the shop time like it used to? I'm pretty sure it does, yeah. So if you happen to be in a battle that lasts forever, then you, you know, like you said, it eats your shop time. So if you have a very long battle, you might not be able to do anything until like your next battle. And then you just kind of locked out of the game. Hasn't happened before, but I have had games where I have like, despite the the timer being like 30 seconds, I might only have like 5 seconds in the shop. Which is not a lot of time. Only slugs. Yes, when you end your turn, only have slugs there. <laughs> Isn't there a popular meme called Ligma or something? Yes, yes there was. That is half of the reference. The other half is that there actually is a Pokemon called Slugma. I remember, because it was in the one Pokemon game that I actually played. Oh yes, guys, so um, again, I have set the timer pretty low, so like the turns are going to go very fast. So I'd heavily recommend going to gameplay, fast forward factor, and 200, because otherwise you may not have a lot of time to do the things you need. I'll give this another like 20 seconds, and I think we're starting. But yeah, I'm going to have to delay the <laughs> the docket a bit. We will not be pivoting in six minutes unless I die in six minutes. Jay's coming. Well, how long is that going to take? I was doing this because it would save time. I don't want to like wait too long. Like, is he here? Is he typing it in? Or is this a he'll be here in like ten minutes when it's already done? Ah, and thank you, Robodoc. Well, he's not saying anything, so... 10 seconds, then I'm touching the button. You snuck in? Glad you could make it. I think we're good, then. Alright, let's go. Oh, he's in. Okay, great. Uh, <laughs> guys, uh, it's the last lobby of the day. We are doing slugs only, so when you end your turn, only have this guy. Or sloths. Any food is allowed, including stuff like uh, banana and honey. You can buy and sell everything during your turns. But yeah, slugs only, and we have a 35 second timer, so the turns are going to go very fast. So let's see if I can find some... Yeah, these are things I like. That is frozen, it just didn't look like it. Okay, we'll be the blue... No, the creamy investors. <laughs> didn't have time to like choose my name. I'm a very good streamer. Aw, thank you, Creepy. You? What are you ooing at? Oh wait, I was going to buy these, wait. <laughs> I mean, I can't even get another one if I wanted to, but... Might as well roll that last one. Kino's a creamy investor. I didn't invest in cream. Or just be creamy. That is not a slug. Funky cat, get rid of it. I don't know if you thought you were buying the same thing that I got, but that was just a buy sell. To get some free rolls next turn. What I'm going to be looking for is guinea pigs. Because guinea pigs are pretty easy combinations. I don't know what you see. The cheetahs themselves are slugs. I am definitely not following. Guinea pig. I get at least one more. Okay. Well, no guinea pigs yet. I'm also wondering if it is worth keeping the apple frozen. Because it may be better to like... I mean, if I get an early one, then it is great. But once I get to tier 4, it may be best to just try and find, like, a banana. Because that's just <laughs> almost like having another slug on the on the field. Okay, come on. Yeah, almost rolled it. Okay. Well, I have two. I will be rolling next turn as well, because... I could combine next turn and then, you know, maybe get an early slug, but I can also do it the turn after next and still might be able to get it early, just a little bit later. So, yeah, I'll look for another turn. You <laughs> triple guinea pig want to take bets? I bet you will get one slug. Uh, I need to check what else is in the pack. The first one isn't going to be the slug, though. You're getting an armadillo, then a slug, then a mantis. That's my cool. Come on, one more. One more, please. 
No. <laughs> I mean, like, I, maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe I can buy these two next turn, roll once, and find another one. Or maybe they'll just, like, show up here at the start of next fight. Next thing. <laughs> Kitty picks for you. Yeah, I'm still looking for my last one. Like, at least I have one combo ready. Like, even if it doesn't work out. Uh, let's combine first. Why not? Pro, yeah. I, I don't know how important it is. No, 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 no. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Let me skip. Let me skip. Free me. Yeah, I'm leaving that. I do not need it. Hey, yeah. One more roll. Small. <laughs> Such a mess. All right. Your phone's way too laggy for this. Oh, the, the fast speed is just... Messes with my head. Zephyr, welcome. Glad you could make it. Just don't roll past it. They're like purple, right? They are purple. Cool. And I'll freeze the platypus. Like, I should have time to, like, do one of those. Okay, so it's slightly larger than average slug. Those should not have stayed on the team. This should also not be here. We're not doing snails. We're doing slugs. Guys, it's slugs. It's this guy. This is a slug. Oh god, okay, I'm taking the, the emojis out of my title. Guys, it's slugs, not snails. It is specifically this tier 4 guy. Okay, let's... there we go. Uh, sell this first, then buy. And sell, and then buy salads, I guess? No reason not to, and they're pretty large. Maybe we should have swapped these two around though. Like this one is larger, but also if um if it barely dies to something, then I'd rather it not have to trade like a 4-4 four, four into something with like one HP. And <laughs> Jess, you haven't seen any slugs. Saffir as well. Okay, well clearly I'm doing I'm doing something right. <laughs> nah, just big luck. Okay. Swap those again. Uh, I could pill a turtle. I could also just find melons later, and there's like really good like buy sell stuff at tier five, so I guess I shall leave that. I'm hoping the snails have been cleared up. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for correcting, guys. I'm sorry if I made it confusing. No. Oh. I mean, it's still a win, but <laughs> weird trade there. I took all the slugs. I did take a few slugs, yeah. A little bit greedy. Uh, yeah, just buy a cell as fast as possible. I don't want to buy the other thing. I, I don't know. Just buy this. I'll, like, save stuff for next turn. You can only roll four times out of ten. It's, it's going to get really rough. I actually kind of regret getting the monkeys, actually, because that's just an extra summon. Which is going to lengthen the fight even more. All that for a draw. How, how long do I have? Like 15 seconds. Okay. Uh, buy these. I'll maybe freeze that. Freeze these. You know what? There we go. There's my shop. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. I've frozen four things that need pills, but I only have one pill. I think next turn, buy and pill a mammoth. Give my front guy melon. And then buy sell owl. Maybe start with that. I think that could be okay. Two lives left and you finally got a slug. Yeah, that might be a bit late. Same with available. I'm very sorry you guys took so long to get the first one. It's definitely rough. I, I can take more melon, but I like the idea of getting some, some more stuff out here. I'm going to leave the tap here, I think. I guess I will freeze that. Maybe should have frozen the pear as well, because it is decent food. But this is solid. No, we still trade. Yeah, we win this. Yeah, this luck for three rounds and lost all the rounds, because mobile lag is horrendous. Yeah, I imagine it is. I'm very sorry, though. I'll not be by selling that. Uh, 
you know what, fine, just rearrange, get this house. Roll for the pill, yes. I don't want that. It's fine, but I don't want it. Next turn, probably pulling Warus, not Mammoth. Although maybe I do pull Mammoth, I don't know. Having extra stats is always nice. Yeah, that seems fine to me. Your tiger ran out with the octopus. Oh, the, the blue ringed octopus, got ya. Yeah, no, mind. we go stats. I'm giving this frozen as well, because, like, <laughs> I wouldn't mind leveling them. But... Yeah, I don't know, I'm just trying to do things fast. Like, I barely have time to do anything, so I just... I don't need to worry about too much efficiency. I just need to make sure I spend all my money. As long as I do that, I won't complain too much. <laughs> I'm taking all your lives. I have not been paying attention to who I've been fighting this whole time. There's, like, no time to... I'm just like spam clicking to go through it as fast as possible. Uh, let's level this. I'm gonna save. Save my wars. Okay. So I'm just hoping if you level a slug, it's going to make it a lot easier for it to trade with another slug when they both like die into each other. But probably makes the most sense to do that with my backline slug. But yeah. As long as I keep winning, I do not care. Combined by accident. God, I'm not looking forward to trying to like shift things around. Okay, well I already replaced Melon, fine. <laughs> nah, okay, so I can double this one as well, but that's kind of nice. I just need to get it... Oh wait, maybe I should have thrown up at the front. Yeah, there's a big mix. There's a couple of big things without good protective equipment at the front, but... There's also a lot of things with Melanana that would one-shot this, so... Yeah, that seemed to work out better, too. Level Slug is actually strong because of how much better the spawns are. Yeah, you get like another, what, 7-7 seven, seven out of it or something? I don't feel like doubles them. Maybe it's not that big, but... You know, it's, it's a noticeable improvement. Take that for a turn, then I'm probably just rolling. Use that as well. Not sure what I'm doing here, because I probably want to Mammoth Pill before I cat pizza. But then I'd still have money left over to buy the pizza, so maybe I'd just keep the cat frozen for a while and roll for new food. That was... that was awful. I think this may be my... no, this is still a win. Never mind, ignore me. That was a very big waste of my peanut guy, though. That's good, just throw it on there, don't really care. Give it back. Come on, I need to see the food so I can freeze if it's good. And you know what? I'm gonna leave that because like it's it's cool leveling things, but I can just stack that on there if I really need. And I'd rather try and find some actual food for the cat or a pill for my other guy. <laughs> it's all good. Lemon OP. Uh, it's probably better than my bananas, but there there are definitely other foods I'm looking for. Maybe I should have frozen the chocolate, like, <laughs> whatever. But now I'll just throw that there, this is nice. I'll probably freeze a snail if I happen to lose, but I'm not expecting it. And then you pop shields and never mind, this can kill through shields now. That would have been fine at the front. Yeah, I just like sacrificed that for no reason. <laughs> and this is actually a scary team as well. If I had more melon, it would have been fine, but yeah, this is my first loss. Come back to Kino still on five lives as usual. Didn't you have a game earlier where you were on like five lives the whole time? I'm going to roll this. Okay. No, that gets like weaker the longer you're in the game. Nah. We're good. I think lemon was a lot better earlier. I don't think it's worth trying to pivot to it now. Spice, though. I definitely would like to have more. Have more peanuts. I <laughs> might say Mammoth Bill before Cat Pizza and we all get it. It is. It is great. Oh, dude, this is like my third Mammoth Bill. It is great how you talk about, like, strategy in this game, though. Just... <laughs> 
Uh, just keep it like this. I'm getting very large. I wish I could like look through the team thing at the top, but I just have no time. If I did, I wouldn't have time to like finish my turn. Okay. Uh, throw this on that one. Buy sell this. Freeze this. Oh, loads of buy sell things here. <laughs> That's great. All right. The reason why I haven't been replacing these is because I've been waiting to try and find more of those. Because like they would have been better with them. Um, well, with a lot of things, they would be slightly better with uh, lemon, but melon maybe as well. Depends if they happen to go against like a tiny other thing. But honestly, they're big enough to just be fine, I think. That shop, I know. Look at it. I even like waffle this. I'd rather it be spread out than on the zebra. And you know what? Unfreeze that. This is for a pill or something, or <laughs> or a cat. That's fine. I like it. Steamer like confirmed. Oh, I will definitely admit that this has been a really like solid run. So in that case, it would have really sucked to have taken a melon there. Bribing the shop. I promise I'm not. Nah, let's do this. And it even hit the cat. That's not what I want. Dude, loads more cool things. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm cheating. <laughs> it's the only explanation. The shops are too good. Like, every shop is amazing. Is this fine? Oh, I actually popped the shield. Yes, yeah, so it's fine. Hey, he lives. You're sitting on four snails. Uh... Start with this. We can always get stats from other things. Like these are almost like capped out anyway. I'm not gonna have time. No, let me finish. There we go. <laughs> There's no time. And now this guy's right at the back. He should not be there. Although he does win, he's gonna trade with that anyway. Oh, he didn't have the. Even if he traded, he would have won. So that was fine. Okay, so let's build this to get rid of it. Buy sell this, and then end on final slug. Uh, I guess I'll freeze these, but I may be done. Like, how many people are left? Yeah, there's just like three of us. And Terry's still in the game. <laughs> build. Sorry, Gino filled the Morris and it didn't hit the one already with peanuts. They actually changed that. It's now impossible for it to hit something with the same equipment. Same with turtles. If you pill a turtle in front of something that already has melon armor, it just skips it and goes to something further back. But yeah, I'm not going to do any more buy selling. So let's just get some stuff on there for now. And I'm going to look for like steak, I think. For steak. That is steak and that's also good food. There's slug just to have the aesthetic. Freeze it in the shop. Thank you for activating my snails. You're very welcome. Okay, it's still solid. I'm sorry if this means you are dead, and I believe it does. So it's me and Terry. Okay. Well, buy this, buy that. Uh, I could take a broccoli. Just do that, make it slightly larger, but... I don't know. GG's, GG's. I think this might be the final fight. <laughs> yeah, that was extremely good value for my first slug. And there it is. Speedy slug victory. It's perfect. The perfect end. Alright. <laughs> GG's everyone. GG's Terry. Could have played it better, probably, but on the other hand, lol. Look, there's a lot of things I could have done better as well. Like, it's, it's hard to think when you have, like, 10 seconds to take your turn. But, yeah, it's nice. It's nice doing these every now and then. So instead, he wins the race. It, it was pretty funny that we did a super speedy lobby, specifically with slugs.